Before we start the reaction video, always remember to support the original content creator by using the links in the description below. And we are on our last one of the day, at least as far as red versus blues, and then we're going to take a short break while I get some water and stuff, because I'm really dying. I need some water and food just for like 5 or 10 minutes. And we'll come back and we'll do some of those anime reactions that we've been meaning to do before we get ready for the podcast later for Comic Convos. But yeah, this should be fun. Uh, this is... Red vs. Blue Season 7 Chapter 13 called up. Let's see how it goes. I think this is this will be six episodes worth, so. I'm sorry, do we know each other? You are Special Agent Washington, former member of Project Freelancer, also known by the designation Recovery One. Also known as prisoner one. 619B. Convicted, three counts dereliction of duty, eight counts of conspiracy to commit treason, and my personal favorite, seven counts destruction of protected classified military property. And you are... I am someone extremely disappointed by the destruction of said property. That is all you need to know. I want to make a deal. I have information that you want. All the information I want was lost in the destruction of Project Freelancer. Not all of it. Agent Washington, if you knew anything that could have kept you out of prison, I am sure it would have come to light during your trial. So if you're quite through with wasting my time... I we'll... know you're missing the Epsilon unit, and I know where to find it. Oh. You have my attention. You disappeared after the events at Freelancer Command. You searched everyone associated with the program. Even the Red Team Troopers, you found. Yes, the ones they... who were found bickering around the store Jeep. There's another group of soldiers, a blue squad. They escaped with Epsilon. I show no record of these soldiers. And you won't, but I know where to find them. So here's the deal. I get you that I love how the dumb thing has become important plot players later. And we forget we ever knew each other. That sounds fair. And I'm gonna need some equipment. Invisibility, overshields, Anything left over from Freelancer. I think we can point you in the right direction for that. Oh shit. That gun is fun as hell though. Do you see it shooting from up above the reticle though? They used to do that so often where the bullets are not coming out of where they're supposed to come. Out of. Gotta use that phrasing. Stalker! Hey Caboose! Oh hey look, it's that guy. You brought these guys? Are we killing each other today? Or pretending to work together. Ah, uh, the pretending version. Oh, okay, cool. Hey dudes, what's up? How'd y'all find me? We got that radio call you sent. The distress signal? And they sent you assholes? That was to help me. I wanted less distress, not more distress. Uh, actually we kind of ignored that call at first. That makes sense. And then Donut showed up and told us you were in trouble. Oh, I get it. So me making an emergency radio call, not a big deal. Nope. Donut telling you some dumb homo story? Red alert. Pretty much. So where's everyone else? What do you mean? The rest of the people who are going to help me fight these fuckers off. You didn't bring any other soldiers, did you? Oh, uh, that depends. Uh, by other soldiers, do you mean people other than us? Yes, I do. Dead. No. What's going on here? Uh, it's kind of hard to explain. They think there's some kind of artifact here. Some massive weapon built a long time ago. An old weapon. Like a spear? No, not a spear. Like some kind of super energy electric thing. An electric spear. It's not a spear, dumbass. Mm, they got heard about these. They found some back during the war. Yeah, well, all the aliens are into them and so are all the humans now. So me and Junior have to go around sometimes and help negotiate stuff. You know, smooth talk. Why you? We're like ambassadors here or something. Humans and aliens seem more comfortable with us since we're kind of, you know, in between. In between aliens and humans, huh? You mean in between two alien and human? Ladies? Come on, dude, seriously? You're not gonna get me to say it with that lame-ass joke. I'm not that easy. Okay, well maybe I am that easy. Bow chicka bow wow. See, now that's a setup. Ha ha ha. Yeah, I hope one day you tell me what you're going to do between the two ladies. So are you part of the group that CT told us awesome. about? That asshole? He's a awesome fucking liar. and awesome. He That's and awesome. killed the guys originally sent to dig this thing up. Then they tried to kill me. Oh, don't. Well, I hope you stopped them. I locked myself in this temple. I figured it would keep me safe and keep them away from the relic. So who are they? I don't have any idea, dude. They're probably trying to steal the artifact, then sell it to the highest bidder. Oh, they're like evil eBay. You're an idiot. Look, guys, thanks for the fucked up rescue mission and all that, but where's Church? Oh. Um, he's dead. Yeah, I know that. Church has been dead for years. It never stopped him before. Oh, yeah, we also found out that he's not a ghost. 
and that he's an AI computer program like Sheena. Yeah, I knew that. You did? Yeah, you guys didn't? Look, pay fucking attention. What the fuck are you guys paying attention to? Uh, I had my suspicions. Of course. I just didn't want to tell anybody. Tucker didn't Still want to know what Tucker is going to do between the two ladies. Look, guys, I need your help. Tucker doesn't know enough to put from his ass to a bell end, bro. Old habits die hard. But why destroy it? Orders. We can't let it fall into anyone else's hands. Plus, breaking stuff is fucking awesome. This thing is that powerful? Hell yeah. First they built these rings that were a huge weapon. Then we found this super powerful cube-shaped weapon. And I guess this is the pyramid version. That ancient race sure built a lot of weapons. I know. I mean, did they really need to spend all their time building stuff to destroy the universe? Like, how about the galaxy's biggest movie theater or, like, some kind of super advanced water park? All work and no play, guys. Seriously. No play. Tell me about it. Wow, chick, wow. Greetings, fellow web surfer. And sure to on to, to episode 14, which is now the installation. And then once again, I'll have to take a little break because I've been doing the live stream for a little while. Um... And I just need some water and shit. I'm dying over here, man. Also got a text from somebody asking me to come into work. I don't know who the there? fit They've was. They've been to blast way in here ever since I locked it down. They're not having much luck, though. Are you fucking assholes? This stuff looks like rock, but it's way tougher. What's tougher than rock? Paper. <laughs> How the fuck should I know? Super <laughs> rock? What am I, Super some kind rock. of geographist? Geographist. Yeah, they just got that thing. I think they think they're gonna yank this door off with it. Not fucking happening. They wanna get their hands on that weapon? Yeah, and we can't let them turn it on, no matter what happens. Well, why don't we just turn it on and use it against them? Fuck, what? We don't know what it does. We can turn it on and it can make us all sterile. Would it do that? Well, the last weapon we found was designed to wipe out all organic life in a huge radius. Wow. What's a radius? I don't know. They just made me learn this crap for my dumb job. Point is, don't touch anything. You hit the wrong button or flip the wrong switch, we'll all be dead before you can say, where's Caboose? Uh, I don't think that's how that expression goes. No, I mean, where the fuck is Caboose? Yeah, uh, you shouldn't yeah. have took your eyes he off him. He does have a habit of wandering off. He's been trying to rig equipment to do something. We don't really know what. That boy is not quite right, you know. He I just said not to touch anything, and you guys let him walk away to find equipment? What the <laughs> hell is wrong with you? So did you, though. Man, I swear, you guys have always been idiots, but this takes a cake. Hey, he's on your team, asshole. Oh, right. Mm -mm -mm. Hey, uh, so if you guys aren't doing anything, you want to help me go find Caboose? Let's go. So embarrassing for you. Just go find the guy. So sad. I fucked your sister. <laughs> so sad. I fucked your sister. <laughs> I think the whole joke was that he never got that far. No, acabo de pegar eso. Esta es el mío. He's here. He's here. They have different. The bad guy, the guy who wants to kill us. Le necesito ser más específico que ese. See, now it sounds even different than last time. Okay, aquí pensé que él es muerto. No, jeez, look out! Son of a bitch! Madre de Dios! Lopez. We need some big guns. Okay, the game with the acid. I'll grab the rocket launcher. Just grab whatever you can, Lopez. I'm trained to handle this weapon. I feel like he is absolutely not Lopez? trained to handle that weapon. Anybody? And again, most people aren't trained All to right, handle their you weapon. Bastard. Prepare to get Simon sized. Well, fuck me. Yeah, I was right. Hey, Lopez. Usted dijo Simmons eyes. Lopez. You broke my motorcycle again. What gun is that? I forgot. That's not the uh, Spartan laser, is it? No. Right? The fuck was that? No. No. Damn, and there's still like six or seven more seasons of this at least. Or like seven or eight. No one has to get hurt. Shut up, idiot! I should have stabbed that fucking speaker while I was out there. Caboose! Caboose, where are you? Hey Blue! Hope you're not dead! Now that there's two of you, we finally have a fair fight! This place is a lot bigger than I remember it being. You guys, shut up. Like, I remember that? having passageways, but not. You're gonna get me in trouble. Trouble? Fuck that. Who's he talking to? Oh, crap. Did somebody break into the temple? No, no. Okay. See, you broke that. See, that was your fault. That, that was already broken. Oh, shit. It's church. All right. Let's charge in there and take these assholes out. On my mark. That means when I say go. That place sounds familiar. 
Yeah, I find it annoying and grating for some reason. Okay, just stop moving around. Hold still. I am holding still. You're the one that's moving. Yeah, that sounds like... Your hand's on me. Fuck it, dude. I'm sorry, Church. Church? <laughs> yeah, but he's an eye. I remember this dumb shit, because now that's the editor. Okay, so they're... Who the fuck are these guys? <laughs> the floating bowling ball. Ah, ah. All right, Where's guys. The so that's... What's up, Forever Alone? That's the so, uh, That was fun. Uh, for now, we're going to go on to a break. Thanks, everyone, for watching another episode of Reactions with an X with me, your host, Axel Grave. I appreciate every single view and every single comment on these videos. If you enjoyed the video, remember to hit like to show your support and hit subscribe to see more reaction videos. If you like the other content we do on the channel, remember to hit the little bell and press all to see all of our videos. Finally, if you wanted to leave us a comment or a suggestion on other material we to do, or just to rip us to shreds, leave a note in the comments and we'll try to get back to you.